This is my amazing view guys. Are you ready for this video? Do you want to see what this video is all about? Okay, watch till the end. The spicing is here. This is so what do you expect in the video? Come along with me. Let's enjoy the video. and my eyes can take it all in so Uganda is Africa and in the background is that man-made lake that we're going to be exploring so guys come along with me let's explore I'm on this man-made lake which I think it's the biggest in Uganda and you guys I hope you will come along with me as we check it out it's so beautiful and yeah let's go ahead it's so huge and it's man-made so, so we're back before the modern civilization and colonization in africa most countries had um, kingdom reign you know like monarchies and uh, this leg was um was dug by subjects of a certain kingdom called Uganda Kingdom and the king by then was called King Kabaka Mwanga or King Mwanga is the one who told the subjects to not dig this whole big chunk of lake because for reasons best known that we have a real big water lake body called Lake Victoria which is shared by three countries which is Uganda, Tanzania and Kenya so he wanted this man-made lake to stretch up to like Victoria and guys I'm told it is a hearsay not first-hand information because uh, in that era I was not part of it so these people dug they dug until this was formed a lake which has lasted for so many 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 years so this is not far from the city and I'm now in Rubaga Lubaga Town Council and uh, this is where we are enjoying this bliss flow so it's very beautiful it's very peaceful it's calm right now and the skies are blue and white and they're so so nice yeah this is how it looks like Oh my god, this is the best man-made black we have in Uganda and sources say that it has sacrificed more people than I can ever imagine. So they told me, you know what, don't be near that water, you don't know when your day is, it can be sacrificed, that even when you're minding your business, that this lake can sacrifice people and guess what, we don't have hippos in here, we don't have crocodiles in here, but you can disappear like even if you are fluent and the best swimmer in the whole world if it is your day of sacrifice that you will disappear like in a twinkling of an eye you will be gone so i decided to stay on this upper island because i don't want to miss you guys so yep yep don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't and more of these videos will be coming up, popping up soon. So yeah, let's enjoy. Spring is 
lives here. when I was talking to people around here but they are so so friendly because I haven't actually mastered the art of you know vlogging in public and you know adding people in it feels so surrounded with these beautiful yellowish flowers don't you guys think this is so amazing because this lake you see was man made. It was dug by people who are Ugandan, who are African, who are natives, and it has lasted for years and years. And the place here is everything you would ever ask for. It's so chill. And people live around, do their stuff, work, and everything around. But yeah, it is what it is. And we are here. Let's go fish. The fish are men. Yep. Now, are these guys that were fishing? Didn't know that they can actually fish from here. But I'm seeing some fishes. because that's where I kind of saw some fishes so they are using those fishes for prey but they are different in kind they are big small different colors and it's so amazing to hear them and chatting in the background it refreshes the mind and soul and the uh, skies are also blue the blizz is everything that you could ever think of and you guys my guys I'm telling you everything that you ever need it's proof for come to Africa more specific in Uganda and you will enjoy oh this is a man-made lake and it is called the Kavakas Lake which simply means the King's Lake um, initially there are so so many birds living in those trees and they have so many nests in there and um, you guys like there, there is so much to watch here and I'm loving it it's my the first time here the sand the <coughs> sand is making the lake it's smaller water high thing the bad side As we wrap up this video, I hope you give it a thumbs up and give it a like and um, subscribe if you haven't. This is our beautiful man-made lake and uh, it's so beautiful. So, guys. This marks the end of the Kalakas um, King's Exploration Lake. Give this video a like and subscribe if you haven't and see you in the next one.